Hi, and welcome back to Break 100 Golf. I'm John. You're going to love today's video because I'm going to go through 20 driving ranges in GS Pro. Starting with the original driving range, I did a flyover of 20 different driving ranges, and then I also did a shot with either a iron, a hybrid, a fairway wood, or a driver. Let's get right into it. All right, the first one is the standard driving range in GS Pro. It's great to dial in your clubs. I use it at least three times a week. I pretty much warm up to play every single time with this driving range, and here it is. Next is Cape Kidnappers. This is actually my favorite golf course in GS Pro right now, and it does have a good driving range as well. It's scenic, has markers down the middle, and has plenty of room for practice. Next is DPC Boston. DPC Boston is a wide driving range. It has plenty of targets and it also has bunkers to avoid and drop in over. Next is DPC Sodgrass. This is a great looking driving range with targets throughout it. Next is the Georgia Golf Club. It is basic and relaxing with no distractions. Next is Greystone, and Greystone is scenic with many terrain changes. It'd be good to test out different types of shots with your clubs.
Next is the Austin Golf Club. It's fully enclosed and fenced in with various targets and bunkers. Next is Hershey Country Club East. It is wide and relaxing with distance markers down the middle with some targets as well. Next is Course of the Dead. Really, it's just plain fun. And as you'll see, I drilled a zombie at about 200 yards with my hybrid. <laughs> Next is Muirfield Village Golf Club, and that is a wide driving range with targets throughout, really great looking driving range. Next is the mountain range. It is secluded and completely remote. Uh, there's a few targets with distance markers down the middle. Next is the night range. Just tons of targets, great looking range. I use this quite a bit. Next is Prairie Knolls. This is a basic driving range, but has some of the best graphics in GS Pro. Really, Prairie Knolls is definitely, in my opinion, a top five golf course, and the driving range has great visuals because of it.
Next is Riviera. It is completely enclosed and it does have great visuals surrounding it. Next is the Winter Wonderland. And that is a wide range with snow coming down and it's surrounded by pine trees and mountains. Next is the top of the rock range. Uh, really, this is a, lots of fun. There's great visuals. It's my absolute favorite driving range to use. Uh, other than the original driving range in GS Pro, there's just lots of cool stuff in it. <laughs> That's cool. Next is Texas Star. And Texas Star is surrounded by dense trees and it's pretty basic. Uh, just plenty of room for all of your clubs. Next is Silver Bay Golf Course, and it is secluded and surrounded by woods and hills. There's distance markers down the middle. Next is the golf club at Black Rock. Um, lots of room with plenty of targets, really good graphics. Next is Whispering Pines. This is a fan favorite GS Pro golf course. Uh, it is secluded. Uh, it's in the woods. I dropped my first shot I did there within the 250 yard circle and walked that one off.
And that's gonna be about it today. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Please smash that like button and share it with your friends who may be interested in GS Pro. As always, I would love if you subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications so that you are notified when I release new content, which is usually about every seven days. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.